Uh, just restart it. Sorry. No, I'm just trying to do this for ambiance in the room. I just wanted a nice, cool feel to the room. Oh. Shit is crazy. What's up with this GameStop, uh, Microsoft deal? What, I, don't, what is... I, don't, I don't know what's up. It seems like it came it. out of nowhere to me. Okay, yes. so it says GameStop and Microsoft entered a multi-year partnership. The deal makes Microsoft's cloud services the backbone of GameStop's back-end and in-store solutions. So they're using oh, Azure now? Reps. So they're basically just going to be like glorified Microsoft stores now? Microsoft about to buy that shit. And that's, that was I the know, it's like, it seems like well the move. They say, you know what? We got stores that's all over the country. We're going to make this to Microsoft stock, goddammit. But it's like... The Microsoft stock. It's welfare. It's just like, look, you said it's we, yeah, it's like, look, we know we just gutted your business because we're not selling no disc anymore out here. Yep. We're, but we're going to throw you a lifeline. But the lifeline involves you actually giving us money. Actually, no, it involves you dying. <laughs> it's like yeah, when uh, no, Haiti won their like revolution. extract more money from you. Oh, boy. Yeah. Uh, yeah, he revolted make, against France, and then France was like, "Yeah, so you owe us about eighteen billion dollars." And it's like, "What, <laughs> nigga? I just kicked you out of my." <laughs> They're trying to rev- revive a corpse. Shit, crazy. It's a Franken- Frankensteinian like thing, like basically. basically. Like, oh yeah, throw some surfaces in there. I think that throw some, yeah, yeah. Which, that's what y'all need. <laughs> well, Microsoft, Microsoft was like, you know what? buying spree anyway. Like I know exactly like, what's missing here. Y'all need more surfaces and more Azure. Boom. You know what, mm-hmm. what we're gonna do? We're gonna make y'all stores into a gaming, a gaming PC shop. They have and more like, money than they know to do it. So that's the way they it. should have been to begin with. GameStop should have always branched into PCs. That's the micro center, but in the mall. That's what they, they like. Basically. That's what they like. I mean, it's have the have the key things that we all we all need: external hard drives, accessible, you know, graphics cards. You know, I'm not saying have a whole solder kit like Micro Center, but just, you know, have the basic shit, like the yeah. basic things that we need as PC gamers. Yeah. Like yeah, GameStop think... thought they bet hard on consoles, and that's they what lost. failed them. Like, as great as consoles are, yeah, it was a terrible yeah. bet. Like, yeah. you had to, you have to bet on the whole gaming ecosystem, and like they. And like what early? I think it was early 2012. They started actually bringing in like nerd stuff into the shops. Like before, it was just games, consoles, mm-hmm. and that's all you'd be able to get in a GameStop. Mm-hmm. And yeah. then they started bringing in like pops just, and and yeah. shirts and tees and stuff like KB that. Toys. Right. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I bought some socks for them. So socks are cool. No, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Like, but they shouldn't. They, they shouldn't be Spencers though. That's not their job. I yeah, found out though that was a little bit too small, so I was upset. <laughs> Give them to your nephew. I, I'm about to. I'm getting them for Christmas. Hey, there you yeah, go. Um, Repurpose a, uh, you know, purchase. I was upset because they were cool socks. I can only fit into like a handful of them. I was, I was very upset. I was like, finally, my nerd stuff is getting is is growing. Hmm. Where is the work? Nope. Um, so, oh, go ahead, Chris. I was about to 